Review 1. It's Just Emotion and Materials and Conductivity. Week 7. Hello! How are you today? I hope you're doing fine. Let's check if you can still remember our previous lessons. Are you ready? Let's start! But before we start our lesson, I want you to prepare yourself as well as your materials necessary for our review quiz. Try to find a nice and comfortable place inside your home where you can focus with our activity. Number 1. Which of the following measures the distance traveled of an object over a given time? A. Speed B. Velocity C. Distance D. Time The correct answer is A. Speed Number 2. Which of the following is a metric unit of measurement? A. Inch B. Feet C. Meter D. Yard The correct answer is letter C. Meter Number 3 which is not a unit of speed? A. KPH B. MPS C. Miles per hour Or D. Second per meter The correct answer is letter D. Second per meter Number 4. Why is a speed of 10 km per hour required at school zone? A. To economize on fuel B. To prevent damage to vehicles C. To prevent vehicles from bumping one another or letter D. To keep the children safe from vehicular accidents The correct answer is letter D, to keep the children safe from vehicular accidents. Number 5. Which of the following is used in measuring length? A. Pencil B. Ruler C. Stick D. String The correct answer is letter B, ruler. Number 6. Which of the following is not an example of insulator? A. Plastic B. Cloth C. Thumbtacks or D. Glass The correct answer is letter C, thumbtacks. Number 7. Which material allows electricity and heat to flow through? A. Capacitor B. Conductor C. Connector or D. Insulator The correct answer is letter B, conductor. Number 8. Which material allows heat and electricity to pass through? A, metal, B, plastic, C, rubber, D, silk. The correct answer is letter A, metal. Number 9. Which materials do not allow heat and electricity to flow through them? A. Capacitors 
B. Conductors C. Connectors or D. Insulators The correct answer is letter D. Insulators Number 10 Water, nickel, and copper are examples of conductors. Which of the following is the common characteristics of the three materials? A. Allows heat to pass through. B. Allows electricity to pass through. C. Allows electricity and heat to pass through. And D. All of the above. The correct answer is letter C, allows electricity and heat to pass through. Good job! You made it until the last question. If you get 10 to 8 points, congratulations! You still remember our lessons. But if you get 7 and below, you can still watch our previous video lessons. See you again in our next one. Bye!